Good afternoon, Sobs. You are first today. One and only. It's actually telling me there's nobody on right now. All right. Let's see. So you just came into view before. You came into view. <clears throat> All right, let's give it a couple minutes. Psalms, I hope you're having a great day today. See some good XRP news that came out. I'm sensing something with XRP. We'll share. We'll go over that in a minute. We'll just let some more people come on. No. 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 All right. Sakani, hello. April, hello. Sarah, hello. Shalom. God bless you all. Royal Roxanne, hello. Brother Barry, hello. Sister Kathy, hello, hello, hello. Nikhil, Marin, God bless you all. The faithful crew. We are the church of the living God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Evangeline Lim, hello, Liberty King, what's up? Awesome, awesome. Man, I'm so thankful for you all coming on today. It's about 2.17 my time. I only have till 3 o'clock, so I got like 40, now it's 2 eight, I got about 42 minutes. Haley, hello. I definitely want to pray with you all. We'll go over a little bit of XRP news, and um, that's awesome. Hey, Kathy, God bless you. You figured out how important Bolt, her importing Bolt. Awesome. Glad you're able to do that. Timothy, hello. Oh, Timothy, share this, please. Y'all, I told you the last couple of days the Lord was dealing with XRP. And, um, well, they launched a, they're launching a stable coin. And it, it, I think I shared news also. People had proof that XRP was working with FedNow. And to me... That's more proof. BT, hello. Justin Crane, hello. I like the start time, 12-12. Awesome. Ultra Run, hello. Richard Sims, hello. Uh, Ada Bank, hello. God bless you. Been praying over you and your channel this week. Oh, Haley, thank you so much. What a blessing. That is a blessing. I'm all about prayer. Brother Terrell, all right. Let's go. Ready for, for the Lord to shift. Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's speaking it for sure, guys. Um, any moment, these coins are a ticking time bomb as far as the wealth transfer is concerned. More news with XRP today. I told you guys to try to get some. Try to keep some. We don't know when what's going to launch when, but I know that if there's a ticking time bomb, it's XLM uh, and XRP. Becca, hello, Shalom. Good to see you as well. <clears throat> awesome, awesome. All right, Mara dreaming, catching three bigger fish with only three casts in short time. Usually when I dream of catching fish soon after money flows, I believe it's about crypto. Yes, yes, yes. It's funny. I, um, I when I checked on Shiba Inu, so I told you the Lord's been showing me patterns of three sevens. And I did a video over a year ago, year and a half ago, when God started dealing with Shiba Inu, uh, about seeing triple sevens, triple sevens. And I believe Shiba Inu is closely linked to the church because that's the word that I got for Shiba Inu. And when I looked at Shiba Inu today, there were three sevens in the price. It was, I don't even know what it was. It was like 28777. So we're ready, guys. We're ready. It's exciting. Um, <clears throat> Kaylee, hello. God bless you. Some XR, like like I said before, some XRP news came out. Uh, I'm going to share my screen in a little bit. We'll go over that. April, all right, first prayer request. All right, Lord, we love you. We honor you today. We pray that you be with us. Bless everything that we do. I pray a special blessing over this body of believers 
in the name of Jesus. Bless them. Bless their health. I speak prosperity over their health, their finances, their relationships, their ministries in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, we lift up April right now in the name of Jesus that you will help her find a new apartment. Give her divine connection, favor. Bless her finances, Father. Put her in the, in the exact location where you want her, where your grace is going to be multiplied and where she is going to grow and thrive in the kingdom of God. God bless you, Dennis. Hello. In Jesus' name we pray. Give her divine, give her wisdom, Father. Give her direction, Father, in the name of Jesus. Haley, let's see. Yeah, it's, it, it's fun flowing in the spirit. I love when you get all these confirmations. It's, I love it. I love it. It's funny talking about sevens because I was watching another channel today and they were talking about XRP and mentioning the office building address across the street being 777. Awesome. Chart. That was a big green candle going up. Marin, that's awesome too. Um, awesome. Thank you for sharing that, Haley. I woke up a short vision of the Shiba Inu chart, a big green candle going up. Man, I'm telling you, the Lord's telling me it's about time. It's about time. Bun me from UK. God bless you. Dennis, God bless you. Chris Hartman. Moses, God bless you. Sue Harrison. Hello. Uh, Ziga Oil Israel, seven cents, sir. $16. Once oil struck. Two different Christians released words this week about Z. So I've heard a little bit about this. I just haven't done much research into it. In Israel, seven cents a share. Going to $16 once oil struck. Wow. All right. Um, and somebody, let, let me just backtrack a little bit, guys. Oh, so, so Timothy, can you share this? The economic ninja, I believe he's a, he is a Christian. Um, and, uh, he's got, he's got a legit channel. I, I, I have seen maybe just bits and pieces of a few of his videos and I like them. Um, all right, let me go back now. So Tim, brother Timothy, you could share what he said on that. That would be that'd be awesome. Uh, Marin, all right, back to brother Marin. I have a prayer request lately. I had a lot of warfare dreams, fighting owls, zombies, and other enemies. All right, Marin, we just pray that the angels of God cover you. We bind these spiritual attacks in the name of Jesus Christ, and we cast them out in Jesus' name. We pray that. The Lord would fortify you with his angels, with his spirit. We put the armor of God upon you in the name of Jesus Christ. We ask that God will anoint you and give you victory over these battles in the name of Jesus Christ. We speak a standard and a hedge upon you and your family in Jesus' mighty name, that God would give you divine strategies, insight, and wisdom how to overcome these enemies in the name of Jesus Christ. Praise God. Ultra run. Hey, got some z -Nag. All right. Where can you get that? Can you get that on an, an on an exchange? April, more praying for rain. Yes, Prophet Manny Z Nago. Uh, what does this hey Paul? What does this mean for XRP? Pray Marin. All right. I brother. Hey, Sonia, God bless you, Sonia. Tyson, God bless you. It's, it's a stock, okay. Uh all right. So, so some I know like um I wonder if you could get it on uh whole uh Uphold. Uphold has some stocks and, and metals and stuff. Um, wow. All right, guys. Yeah. You got some XRP, right? Um, we're not just not financial advice, but my personal opinion, we're not just waiting for these seed coins to take off. God forbid. XRP runs to $5 first. We want to capitalize on that. Um, something's going on, XRP. Something's going on. And we saw today, I'm going to share the news. We got about 74 on right now. I'm going to go to the news. I'm just going to read a couple more comments. And then I'm going to go to this. The XRP has announced a stable coin. And the U.S. government's been talking about we need to use stable coins. And who's got clarity? <laughs> so... XRP is going to get full clarity. U.S. stable coins working with Fed now, I believe, along with XLM. And these coins are just going to be bye-bye. 
so he said, big news for XRP backed by the U.S. dollar treasury. Fields may have a backdoor deal with the government over the lawsuit. That sounds about right, Brother Timothy. Thank you for sharing that. Thank you for sharing that. Uh, Ultron got some through Charles Schwab. Okay. Regular trading accounts. You not go TC stock. Thank you, Chris. Uh, Bun me. All right. Bun me says, please pray for my husband's salvation. Married 24 years now and have been praying for his salvation for 12 years now. All right, Bun me. We lift up your marriage. We lift up your husband and we speak salvation over him. We pray that the Lord would fill him with his spirit. We pray the Lord would give him the want to, the desire to serve him and live for him, that God would send forth messengers to preach to him, Christians beside yourself to pray for him. I ask that the Lord would give your husband visions and dreams that he is the Messiah and that he's coming very soon, that the Lord would give him the want to, that the Lord would help him bless his faith, to put his faith in the living God. We speak life over your husband, we speak unity in your marriage, and we pray that the Lord would reach for your husband in Jesus' name. Thank you, Adam. Bless his brother. Greg. Hit the thumbs up. You know, I'm on this, I'm on stream, StreamYard, which when you're live, there'll be no commercials, which is good. I don't want commercials when I'm live and, you know, um, and also I could do this. I could put comments up. So, you know, it makes it easier for everybody to read when we're addressing certain comments. So I like it, but I see that there's 76 people on, but I don't, I'm not able to see the likes and I'm okay with that. So thank you, brother Adam. And Okonye, had two Shiba Inu. All right, let's take a look at this. Had two visions of Shiba Inu. They were clear. It's going to be an overnight thing. I was losing money and I was sad, wanted to remove my money. Then suddenly the market moved up. Thank you for that. That's a good word. That's a good dream. Ultra run. X coins. We've been seeing X's everywhere. I'm not doubting that. I'm behind this. Fidelity, Charles Schwab. Regina, thank you, Regina. God bless you, Regina. Uh, prayer, please. Okay. There's a lot of us that, that are in this boat, Haley. So I'll be happy to pray for this and everybody on here. Uh, please pray for a financial miracle this month. My husband didn't make commission for car sales. It's bad right now. We have small kiddos and not sure what to do about the mortgage. God will come through. God will come through. Keep speaking faith. Keep speaking faith. I remember our first house, we 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 gave, it was a, it was a missions pledge fund. Let me just testify because God's not a respecter of persons. And we had one month mortgage payment saved up. I might have shared, I probably shared this on here, so but it bears repeating. And for the missions, the it was you know, it was a small house we got on a short sale. So the mortgage wasn't much. It might have been like, I don't even it wasn't even two thousand a month. And we had that, let's just say two thousand put away. Um, you know, for a rainy day. We had one mortgage payment saved. Um, for an emergency and it, we're doing a missions pledge offering and just we pray and this is what I believe this is because I I'm a product of my pastors and my pastor would always say they would never ask anybody for a specific amount of money they might say we need to raise this amount of money but they said let's pray and what the Lord puts in your heart because why the Lord wants a cheerful giver a cheerful giver we're not supposed to you know, stir each other up and anyhow, beg and plead and all that. So <clears throat> the Lord puts the number of the mortgage payment that I had in my savings account. And it was one of these ones. And I'm sure you guys have done this before. If you're married, I said, please give that number to my wife. <laughs> and sure enough, I said, did you get a number? She said, I did get a number. She said, what number did you get? I said, it was $2,000. And she said, the Lord gave it to me too. So that was, God helped us there. That was our confirmation. And let me tell you that giving it was the easy part because we gave it. And that week I lost my job. So, Haley, as your husband's commission doesn't go down, this is going to minister to you. And we're going to speak this and we're going to pray for this right now. But I want to 
this word is God's word is always alive. His testimony is always alive. He's the same God yesterday, today, and forevermore. All right. So I lose my job that week. And now we come to the beginning of the next month and we don't have the mortgage payment. We're short. And it was the day the mortgage was due. And I remember talking to my wife and she's like, um, she's like, right, well, we gave our mortgage payment to the Lord. And, you know, there might have been a little worry there. That's right. She's sitting behind me. So she hears me. And, um, you know, I rose up in faith and I said, no, I said, you can't outgive God. I said, God is going to come through. What did Haley just say? God will come through. As I said that, my phone rings. As I was saying it, in the presence of the Lord, I'm telling you this, my phone rang. Answer my phone. Brother Greg, it was it was an elder in the church. God moved on my heart, whatever. I, We want to bless you. And they blessed us. The blessing not only covered my mortgage payment, but it covered our bills for the next couple months. Couple months. We can't outgive God. And this is why it's safe to be sowing and paying tithes and giving God control of your finances. Because when you need it, you could say, Lord, I've been faithful in my giving. Now you could, now, Lord, you're a provider. And he's going to show up. Haley, in the name of Jesus Christ, I speak a financial blessing over your husband, your over you, your husband, and your family right now in the name of Jesus. We speak that that mortgage payment will be paid in Jesus' name. We ask that the Lord, Lord, I ask that you'd open the windows of heaven right now and pour out upon Haley and her family right now in the name of Jesus Christ. There's no lack in you, Lord. You are Jehovah Jireh. We speak Jehovah Jireh over this situation. The Lord, God, our provider. I speak that mortgage payment to be paid not only this month, but months to come in the name of Jesus. All your bills to be paid. And I pray this for everybody on here right now that's dealing with this. Father, everybody in the body of Christ that you've led me to, that has been led to this page, that calls this page, this, this platform a home. Bless them. Multiply their finances. Take care of their mortgage payment, rent payments, car payments, loans. In the name of Jesus Christ, I speak it now, Lord. And I, I believe I'm in your will because you've been speaking increase to me. And you speak those things that are not as though they are. Though we haven't seen it fully manifest yet, Lord, you're manifesting answers to prayers financial blessings, healings, Lord God. Here's another financial blessing in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, we are just speaking what you have been promising us. Lord, we're decreeing it back to you in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let it be done, Lord, according to thy will and to, thy word, to your word. And let me just speak. There's nothing better than speaking the word of God in prayer and back to the Lord. And I, Haley, I speak this over you. I speak this over myself right now and everybody on here right now that are going through financial hard times, that our God, my God, your God shall supply all of our need according to his riches in glory. Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you. Philippians 4.19, Matthew 6.33. So we claim that word. We claim the word of God in Jesus' name. Praise God. Um, DJ T Stock. Becca, I'm not sure about that. Please pray for my sister. Has been battling colitis infection. All right, Regina, we lift up your sister right now. We bind that colitis infection in Jesus' name and we cast it out of your sister. We loose the healing virtue of God upon your sister. We speak life over her. We speak healing. We bind the infection in Jesus' name. It's gone now in Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Wow. Okay, man. Thank you for that. Hey, Shannon, God bless you. We've been praying for you, Shannon, in Jesus' name. We pray the Lord continues to heal you and strengthen you in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you for jumping on. I know it's hard during the middle of the day because people are busy. Allison, I don't know if I said hello to you. Hello, hello. Catch a few moments here. KK, God bless you. Great things are happening for you. Yes. <laughs> Amen. I love it. Love this. KK said, hi, Trixie Lynn. Just same, just catching a few moments on here. Praying for you, Shannon. Great things are going to happen for you, our sister, in Jesus' name. Yes, Harry, you the man. God bless you, brother Harry. Only 19. That's okay. 
Uh, great. Likes have gone up to 30. All right. All right. Thank you guys for that. Ultimately, I just want the Lord to move. I just want him to move. I just love hearing these requests and praying for each other. And he will take care of the growth of this channel. I was into the growth of the channel. I'm not anymore. Now that I stepped into my calling, it's like, I can't tell you. It's something I've never experienced before. I This, this calling has been prophesied over my life for 16 years. 16 years. And I just... All right, Lord, when? This is my passion. This is my heart. I had a business. I made money. It didn't fulfill me. As I knew, this is what I'm called to do. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. All right. Thank you, Dennis, for sharing that. Woo. I was at my church today doing yard work. When I looked up, I saw a giant X in the sky. Yep. It's coming, y'all. It's coming. Man, what are you doing with Southern XRP? The ancient rival who I am. Cannot give God. That's right. Wow, praise God. XRP, stable. All right, yeah, let me share that with you guys now. God told last day's YouTuber XRP was an early investment like Amazon. Uh, it's going to go to 10000 a token. Whew. Jesus' name. Amazing. Amen, amen. Thanks for your prayers. My business... Thanks for Prince said, thanks for your prayers. My business school accepted me. I just have to find a company now. Glory to Jesus. Amen. We give God praise and glory for that, Prince. Awesome. Thank you, Jesus. That God will finish the work that he started for you, Prince, in Jesus' name. AC Cobra, I see XRP in a thousand. Just getting warmed up, AC Cobra, right? Just getting warmed up. Good in my finances. But every day I thank God for those. Who's... Amen. Well, Prince, we lift up you and we pray blessing over your finances, especially while you are learning and educating yourself that God's grace and favor will be poured out upon you in Jesus' name. All right, Terrell, we got a prayer request, Brother Terrell. Pray for my wife's foot. Doctors want to diagnose, doctors want to diagnose her with God. We are believing that she is healed. All right, Terrell, we lift up your wife right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We bind any infirmity any kind of sickness, whatever this is, we bind it in Jesus' name and take authority over it. We cast it out. We lose healing upon your wife's foot now in Jesus' name. Blood flow, healing by the stripes of Jesus. She is healed, Terrell. Your wife is healed in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, Lord, bring strength and healing, mobility to her foot. We bind and rebuke the pain in her foot, command it to leave now in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Marquita, hello. So glad to have you on. God bless you, Marquita. Amen. Amen. Groceries to that home would overflow the abundance of God's. Amen, Becca. For Haley, groceries to that her home would overflow with abundance for God's glory. When my kiddos are small, I'd receive envelopes of money in the mailbox in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Becca. So you got the miracle. God's done it for you, and now you're speaking it. I love it. Praise God. Yes, amen. Amen, Bunny. Yes, we were all praying together, but thank you for that encouragement. Yes. We're two or three, right? We, we're, we're, powerful. we're more powerful together. Nothing takes place of your private prayer time, but then there's a time when we do corporate prayer time, and I believe sometimes... It's going to take a couple of brothers and sisters to break through some things that we wouldn't be able to necessarily break through on our own, though God can do all things. I'm not putting God in a box, but there is a special blessing and power, I believe, when we unify in prayer. 100%. Hallelujah. Edith from South Africa, please pray for my children. We have been going through a lot. Edith, we'd be happy to do so. Edith, we lift you and your family up right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We lift up we lift up you and your children and we speak grace over them. We speak healing and unity over them right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We speak the angels of God to come and minister to the heirs of salvation. I pray for God's strength to come upon you and your children. I pray that the Lord pours out his spirit upon your family, brings healing and unity. We bind every attack whether human or demonic, coming against you and your children and your family right now in Jesus' name. We take authority over it and we cast it out 
in the name of Jesus, that the Lord would loose you with the spirit of the Lord as there's liberty. I speak liberty over you and your family right now in Jesus' mighty name. All right, Psalms. Viser, God bless you. I see you, Viser. Um, All right, guys, I got about 20 minutes, but this is good. This is exactly what I wanted to do with y'all. Praying for my granddaughter. She has multiple blood test appointments. May 2nd, 2024, playing that her blood work will show nothing positive. Will, uh, will show nothing positive. Okay, in the name of Jesus, Psalms, we lift up your granddaughter right now. We pray, we pray for healing in her blood and her body in the name of Jesus Christ. We bind every sickness, disease, infirmity in the name of Jesus. We cast it out. We lose the healing virtue of God, the balm of Gilead. By the stripes of Jesus Christ, she is healed. We pray for good news from the doctor in the name of Jesus. Negative uh, diagnosis report, negative reports. Positive from the Lord, negative from the doctor. Blood work showing negative. That's what I'm trying to say. Yes, Bonnie, thank you for praying for Brother Terrell's wife. Awesome. Love this. Amen, amen, amen. Ooh, blessed are the feet who bring the gospel of Jesus Christ. Amen. We just want the Lord to move in our lives. May we be stationed exactly where we're meant to be, geographically, spiritually, legally, financially, relationally. Yes, this is awesome. KK, I'm going to lift this up. Yes, Lord, we ask that you move in all of our lives. We come in agreement with KK's word right here in her prayer. Lord, may we be stationed exactly where we're meant to be ge geographically, spiritually, legally, financially, and relationally in the name of Jesus Christ. Let it be done according to thy word in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Royal Roxanne, new member, welcome, welcome. God bless you. Amen, amen. All right, in the mighty name of Jesus. All right, awesome. Just, just some news for you guys. Let me share this. You've seen a little surge in XRP price, and I told you the last couple of days God was dealing with me with XRP, but this is just not even scratching the surface. But um, take a look at this. So Brad Garlinghouse put this out this morning. Launching a stable coin is a natural step for Ripple as we bridge the gap between traditional finance and crypto, right? Old archaic system to new digital system. What do you know? We have won. Uh, we have won the years of experience. One, we have the years of experience. Two, regulatory footprint. What is he saying here? Three, a strong balance sheet and a network with near uh, near global payout coverage to offer the best crypto enabled payments using XRP, our future stable coin together. And this was the news. Ripple put this out. Uh, the stable coin market is booming around 150 billion today, and the project it's projected to soar to 2.8 trillion by 2028. There's a clear demand for trust, stability, and utility. That's why later this year we'll we will be launching a stable coin pegged one one to the U.S. dollar on the XRP ledger and Ethereum. This is interesting. Maybe this will be done away with. And the positive companies that were on Ethereum that are going to be sticking around will end up on XRP because this is far superior than this. That's my personal take. The move extends Ripple's reach into both institutional and DeFi realms, diversifying use cases, enhancing our payment infrastructure to bring the, wor the worlds of traditional and decentralized finance closer together. Ripple's stablecoin will be 100% backed by the U.S. dollar deposits, the U.S. government bonds, and cash equivalents, and Ripple pledges transparency with, month with the uh, monthly third-party uh, attestations, ensuring trust and reliability. Stablecoin serves as a pivotal entry point to DeFi and introducing a trusted enterprise Great stablecoin to the XRP ledger will generate more use cases, liquidity, and opportunities for developers and users alike. Simultaneously, we know the future of crypto is multi-chain. Launching the stablecoin on both XRP ledger and Ethereum opens the door for cross-chain interoperability. Interoperability, that's a tongue twister. Ripple's move into the stablecoin isn't just about innovation. It's about contributing the XRP ledger 
ecosystem and setting the stage for more robust, diverse landscape. Wow. So here we are, right? Yeah, we're, we're right where we need to be. Um, uh, oh, I missed a, a prayer request here. Sanju. All right, let's see. All right, we got a prayer request here. Becca's new member, welcome aboard, Becca. Did I skip anybody? Uh, okay. All right, victory 2023. 20, Pray for Noah and Katrina, both fighting for their life, uh, fighting for their life in my community, swelling to go down for Noah and Katrina for brain activity to increase after having a massive heart attack. All right, we lift up Noah and Katrina. Whew, we pray for brain activity to increase in Katrina in the name of Jesus Christ. We speak complete healing in her brain, cognitive function to, to be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. We, we pray for the swelling to go down in Noah and Katrina in the name of Jesus. We speak life over Noah and Katrina. We speak healing over them. We bind the spirit of death and we cast it out. And we lose the healing virtue of God upon Noah and Katrina right now in Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Lord, if they're not saved, save them. Pour out your spirit upon them in Jesus' name. The next wave of the bull run, I feel it's coming possibly after a weekend around the eclipse. Wouldn't surprise me. Casey, I, I agree with you. Noah is in middle school. Wow, I was just a child. Right when he put that out, price surged that hour. Wow. Ooh. Fritz Fuddle, blessings from South Africa. Please pray for my daughter, Madison. Uh, she applies for acceptance of Pretoria University of Study Medicine and, and that we have enough funds to pay for it. Yes, in the name of Jesus. We lift up your daughter, Madison, right now. Lord, we ask for your blessing as she applies to this university, Lord, that she will get accepted in, for Pretoria University, in Jesus' name, that you put your favor upon her, give her favor with all those that are in the process of getting her accepted into this school. We pray, Lord, that a special blessing upon Fritz and his family, upon their finances, to be able to cover her education, her university education, in the name of Jesus Christ. Lord, we lift this up to your throne of grace. Lord, make a way, make a way, provide for this family. Enable, enable Madison to get into this school for medicine and for it to be paid for in Jesus' name. Amen, amen. Wow, amen, Casey. Especially if the price comes down a little this week and the next wave could be soon on the third test, the level, uh, the third retest of the level it just bounced off of today. Casey, we're talking about XRP, correct? Uh, all right, we got about 108 on right now. All right, amen, amen. All right, y'all, I'm gonna I'm gonna close in prayer. I gotta I gotta get my little guy, well, both of my boys. Um. All right, in Jesus' name, let's let's all just pray for each other and be led. Be led of the Spirit. Let me just take this off of here. Where is it? All right. All right. In the name of Jesus, Father, we, I pray a special blessing over everybody on here today in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, with all the chaos and the turmoil in the world, I pray safety and protection over our families, over our children, over our loved ones, Father, in the name of Jesus. We decree and declare that no pestilence, no virus, no disease will come near our dwelling in the name of Jesus Christ. We will dwell under the shadow of the Almighty, Lord God, in your secret place. Keep us, Lord God. Provide for us, Lord. You are a provider, Lord. I ask for extra blessings of provision, and I believe that's why you led us to this crypto, and that's kind of how we all met, Lord God. But we are the church of the living God. We are so much more for that. We're not living for this wealth transfer, Lord, but we know it's just a piece of what you're doing. It's a tool for end-time revival, Lord God, and you've led certain people to it, and we thank you for that. Breathe and multiply our coins right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Help us to be in the position that you want us to be in. Give us wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. I'm asking for a spirit of wisdom 
and revelation to come upon each one of us right now in the name of Jesus. Yes, yes, we're going to put on the armor right now, Casey. We put on the armor of God right now. We put on the helmet of salvation to protect our minds, our thoughts from the, from the wicked one. We have the mind of Jesus Christ. We put on the breastplate of righteousness. Lord, our actions, words, thoughts, and deeds will be in righteousness. Set our feet on paths of righteousness. Oh, hallelujah. Guard our heart for out of it are the issues of life, Father. Let the breastplate of righteousness guard our vitals, our spiritual vitals, in the name of Jesus. Lord, we gird our loins with the belt of truth. Lord, we will stand on the truth of your word. Lord, continue to give us revelation. Protect us from deception and false doctrines. For there are many false Christs that are coming through the earth, Father. But Lord, we will worship the one and only true God, Jesus Christ. Protect our family from being deceived, Lord God. Protect us from being deceived from anything, from investments to businesses to um, decisions we have to make, Lord God. Keep us from deception. We shot our feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace. Lord, we will walk in peace and we will proclaim your gospel. I ask for peace to be multiplied upon each one of us right now in Jesus' name. Your peace that passeth understanding to guard our minds and our hearts in Christ Jesus. Oh, hallelujah. You are the God of all peace, Lord. We receive your peace right now. We receive your liberty. We receive it, Lord God. We receive freedom in the spirit. Hallelujah. For we will walk in the spirit. For the law of Christ has set us free from the law of death and condemnation. For there is now for no condemnation to those that are in Christ. We will walk in freedom and liberty in the spirit. Lord, we take the shield of faith to quench all the fiery darts of the enemy. Lord, we will walk by faith and not by sight. Let's be careful what we're looking at there and keep our eyes on Jesus because there are storms swirling all around us. There are wars and rumors of wars. And if we keep our eyes on that, guess what? We're going to begin sinking as Peter began to sink when he took his eyes off the Lord. But no, no, we're going to rise up. We're going to walk on water, which is a typology of walking in the miraculous. I speak right now, we will walk in the miraculous in the name of Jesus Christ. We take the sword of the spirit, which is the rhema word of God. We decree and declare that we are free in Christ, that we are accepted in the beloved, that nothing shall separate us and our families from the love of Christ. We receive the love of Christ right now in the name of Jesus Christ. We decree and declare that we are lenders and not borrowers in this season. We decree and declare that the Lord will provide all of our need according to his riches and glory. We decree and declare unity in our families and our marriages. We decree and declare we are healed in Jesus' name, physically, emotionally, spiritually. We are healed in Jesus' name. The rhema word of God of promises that God's given us. We decree and declare that our finances are blessed. We decree and declare that we are millionaires and billionaires for the kingdom of God for such a time as this. Hallelujah. We decree and declare that we are the head and not the tail. We are above and not beneath in the name of Jesus. We decree and declare that we are more than conquerors in Jesus Christ. Praise God. Praise God. All right. Well, God bless you all. Love you all. Have a blessed day today. I will see you tomorrow, probably later morning. All right. Have a great day. Yes, Casey, we are in agreement in Jesus' mighty name. All right, y'all. God bless you.